Yo guys, you wanna hear a story of how I lost my leg? Oh shit, no, free, that's not free. So, how I became crippled, or at least disabled for now, is a really, really long time ago. I don't know, seven, eight years ago. I think I was playing basketball. And I was just like, you know, just vibing around school. And uh, I started feeling a bit of pain on my right knee. So I was like, ooh, why, what is that pain? That is a uh, very nice pain. I was like, mm, maybe my knee is just like not feeling it today. You know, maybe it's just a daily thing. So I, I moved on next day. Uh, it hurt again. It, it, it was painful again. I was like, ow. Well, that's not right. Maybe something's wrong with my knee. Uh, it will be fine. I went to school like, you know, the next few weeks and then uh, it got worse. So I was like, wow, okay. So th there is pain coming from my knee. Uh, maybe I just like, you know, okay, I'm gonna demonstrate it with this knee. I'm gonna hit it back into place because maybe it's misaligned, you know, maybe the knee just went like, uh, nope. So I hit it back into place, didn't really, didn't really work. I, it numbed it, but it was fine. It was fine, okay? It was fine. Doing the leg press thing, you know, where you, where you push your legs against the machine, uh, my right knee just gave up. Doing lunges, my right knee just gave up. So I suddenly couldn't do lunges or squats. Uh, come start of last year, I went through boot camp, military, you know, classic boot camp. The problem is I did tell them about the knee. I was like, yo, you know, my knee might have some might have a problem, you know? It might not be as good as you think, you know? And he was like, What do you want? And I was like, oh, wait, what, what do you mean, what do you want? I was like, no, 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 what, what do you actually want? Then I said, okay, I, I need an MRI because, you know, army pays for everything. So I was like, I need an MRI. I need to check out the knee. I am I will go through boot camp, you know, full boot camp. I'll, I'll do it. But uh, just get me an MRI so that I can make sure that my knee is fine. And I was like, no, 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 what do you, what do you actually want? Like, what, what do you actually want? I was like, huh? It's like, no, no, what, what can you not do? I, I can't do lunges and squats. It's like, okay, I'll give you seven days of no lunges and no squats. Uh, get out of here. I was like, no, 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 I, I need an MRI. It's like, it's like a real chronic condition. You know, it's a real big problem. And uh, he was like, yeah, bye. Next. I was like, okay, yeah, interesting. I went through the entire boot camp. I was posted to my unit or like I was given my job and my knee was not feeling it. It was just not having it. And uh, I went back to the doctor. This is a different doctor this time. And uh, he was like, oh, dude, why didn't you tell us earlier? And I was like, okay, no. I was like, yo, I did. He was like, he was like okay, I'll, I'll give you an MRI. Uh, it will probably happen in the next three or four months and then you'll be fine. So I got the MRI. <laughs> Finally got my results back last year, September. And the results was, yeah, this is pretty serious. You have a torn ligament. Uh, you know, the doctor was like, no treatment. Uh, it's pretty simple, surgery. I was like, huh? <laughs> what? Dude, I, I had a clean record the whole of my life. You know, I've been SSing everything. No stitches, no injuries, like literally perfect run. And then I not only slider broke, I literally just failed. I just died. So yeah, apparently I had to go for surgery and uh, he scheduled my surgery. I told the whole army, you know, about it. They were like, whoa, we didn't see that coming. Went for the surgery and now we're here. The ceiling is unfamiliar. Okay, why didn't do that? Slay. Slay. I can't walk for the next six to eight weeks because of this thing. And uh, I'll also be out of the army for the time being. So that's why I'll be trying to stream a bit more often. Uh, sorry, I've been ignoring chat, but that's the story of how I lost my legs. I mean, had the meniscus, lat lateral meniscus surgery. Yeah. A really expensive fee for the hospitalization, which was like, what, $14? It's crazy, right, Americans? <laughs> wow. You slider broke and got a 50. Yeah, no, that's literally that. I'll be at home for most of the time. So do subscribe. I mean, do follow my Twitch channel. You, do you know how hard is it? Do you know why I don't want to hydrate every time you guys hydrate me? This is how long it takes for me to get up just to go to the toilet, all right, all right? Firstly, game my hair. Pretty cool. I'll get my crushes. Oh, hell yeah. And then I start like waddling around the room. It's really fun guys. Thanks for the hydrate by the way. Yeah, so that's that's how I kinda be now, you know. It's kinda gonna be like that. But uh thanks to you know, thanks to being on the crutches for a while, I've learned how to, you know, stand on one side and then activate the other for quick jabs, you know, just in case someone comes through the window to steal my stuff of Homa for some reason. Chainsaw man, but it's crutches man. <laughs> yeah, this how do you shower, bro? Not easy. <laughs> it's really not easy. So what, what I do, and uh, this is gonna trigger a few people, but uh, I use this thing called a plastic bag with a hole, 
and then I put it through my leg. I take this thing off first, you know, because this thing can come off, but I'm just supposed to wear it. And then I, oh, feet review. And then I cover the bandaid with the plastic bag, and then I tape around the bag, you know, and then I go to shower. Wow, really cool. But uh, yeah, that's, that's why I went for surgery. That's why I'm missing a leg, and uh, I'll be coming back soon, guys. Cheers.